doing this. Good. Folks, my first guest tonight is one of the stars of Sabrina, the Teenage Witch, and a frequent guest on the all-new Hollywood Squares. Please welcome a very funny lady, Caroline Ray. <laughs> Thank you for coming. <laughs> well, nice of you to have me. Yes. Well, this is uh, because you're everywhere these days. This is a high honor. You were co-hosting uh, Regis and Kathy Lee this morning with Regis. I was, yes. Who's also a talented cartoonist. And uh, <laughs> I'm you, no hidden talent, sorry. Yeah, uh, oh, yes, you do. You also have a sitcom. Uh -huh. You're on a game show regularly. Uh -huh. The only thing you're not doing is one of those AT&T ads, which <laughs> everyone else seems to be doing. Have you thought about doing one of those? I know. I want to do one of those. Have you noticed something very strange about the phone company lately? Like, I was making a phone call. And as the phone was ringing, a voice comes on and says, the phone is ringing, but no one is answering. <laughs> and I'm thinking, because whoever you are is on the phone, get off. <laughs> and, and then it has this thing, we can leave a message for a fee of 75 cents. I was like, that's what they have the answering machine for and it's free. And then they'll say, so I figured, let's give this person stay on the phone. <laughs> like, just, it would be so much more interesting if they stayed on for the whole conversation. Like, the person that you're talking to is lying. <laughs> uh -huh. That man is sleeping with another woman. <laughs> and it wasn't his mother on the other lot. We can give you her name for a fee of 75 cents. <laughs> Wouldn't that be better? That would work. Yeah. I'd be up for that. I was, uh... I was home the other day, I was home the other day, and the phone rang, and I just picked it up, and, and this guy just went, hey, Conan. <laughs> and I went, yeah, and he went, oh, this is MCI, and, you know, he started to say, but he just, he, he, the way he addressed me was like a guy who I would know, so, you, you know, do you want this kind of service, that kind of service, I went, no, that's all right, and he went, Conan O'Brien, the talk show guy. <laughs> <laughs> like, you're working for MCI, you shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> But we're pals now. We're hanging out. Um, you have, you've been on the show, I think, uh, you know, four or five times. And every time I am struck by your enthusiasm, you seem like a very up, happy person. What's your secret? Antidepressants. <laughs> no, um... <laughs> Try mixing that with hairspray. <laughs> You're very high, happy hair. Yeah. No, um, <laughs> you know what? I do yoga. Yoga, I don't know if you know this, but it's a Sanskrit word, which means just try not to fart. And, um... <laughs> did you not know that? Okay. Didn't know. Wasn't aware. Now you know. <laughs> Makes sense, though. Uh, but um, you enjoy the yoga? You like that? I do. I like the yoga. Yeah. I'm obsessed with working out. I've been doing the zone. Do you know that diet? No. Actually, I've been doing the cal zone. Okay. Um... <laughs> Joke, Boy. Not doing it, and then going for it. Okay. I didn't know we were in a nightclub. <laughs> Can you give me a microphone? Yeah. Can we get some drinks over here? Uh... Have you tried, uh, have you tried uh, lifting weights at all? I mean, I, yeah, I that have. can relieve stress. And... Yeah. I, <laughs> I, um, I'm obsessed with this machine, actually, at the gym. <laughs> the vending machine. <laughs> <laughs> You're killing, Shecky! <laughs> You know how to deliver those is you gotta like say the setup on on this camera and then turn to that one. Like you could try to saying I like a machine and then do the banger right there close on that one. Let's try that again. Here we go. I am only here to be mocked by you. I'm your favorite fodder. Yes, uh, I now, understand you were uh, trying this new machine. Uh, <laughs> I have a new machine at the gym. Wait, that one? Yeah. Okay. Do the setup on that one I'm and then right. bang it on my nuts, baby, right there. <laughs> That's the way to do it. I'll set you up. Okay, here we go. Okay. Caroline, I understand you're no, working I'm out. No, a different one. Everyone knows that one now. Okay. All right, ask me if I've been working out a lot. You've been working out a lot? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Killer. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? You've been working out a lot, Caroline? I want my ass to be so high and round, people think I'm a hunchback. <laughs> See, that works every time. You know what I do that makes me really happy? I know, could my cleavage be any bigger and longer tonight? I don't know what happened. Um, no, um, yeah. Wait, stop, stop it! Stop it! No. Stop it right now! Or I'll swat you! Oh. Oh. Get that one, honey. What? No, you didn't go like this. You went like that, thank you. There was like a lift. 
acting gesture involved. <laughs> no. Yeah. I'm a sloppy mime. I'm not good with the, I should stick to the simple things. <laughs> Watch me know. walk against the wind. Uh, <laughs> I do affirmations. Do you know what those are? Oh, I'm still feeling that. Uh, <laughs> what, no, affirmations. <laughs> I've, well, I've heard of affirmations. Uh, it's like when you say something and you want it to happen. <laughs> and you say it as if it's already happened. Like, I am a successful whatever you want. What do you want to be? All right, you're successful. Okay. <laughs> what do you want to be? <laughs> it's, a, it's a space of honesty. <laughs> Uh, an that, astronaut. Right, I am a successful astronaut. So sure. you would say it as if so you it say that happened. over and over again. Right. And then one time, <laughs> you know what I love on this show? It's like you know you're going to bomb, and then you have the pre-bomb. Okay, here goes. Um, <laughs> <laughs> what, what are you talking about? I've heard nothing but laughter. All right, all right. I'll get but that's because I'm okay. insane. <laughs> when I'm at home alone in the bathroom, I hear laughter. <laughs> They love me. Anyway, I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, so I was I I um had gone to the gynecologist and I had like a scary pap smear and this new boyfriend of mine picked up like a piece of paper to write down a message and he wrote, "I have a pink and healthy cervix." <laughs> Is that yours? <laughs> I was like, "In mm, mine." <laughs> yeah. You know what's a very funny comedy word? Cervix. Okay. Um, <laughs> Our director in the booth was like, huh? Whoa! Uh, we're just about out of time, but I understand you're, you're going to Disney soon. And the last time you were here, you were going to Disney. Are you just obsessed with Disney World? You know what's really sad? I thought I was like the biggest star because I was at Disney World and I have to have like a bodyguard there. And I gave like 500 autographs and I was like, I'm a huge hoo-ha. And I looked through this child's autograph book. Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> Tigger. Snow White. Caroline Ray. I was the only non-fictional character who didn't have paws. So I was like, oh, I'm very big. It'd be great if Tigger was like, uh-uh, kid, forget it. <laughs> yeah. Tigger yeah. was like a real creep, you know? <laughs> I'm um, going to Charlotte, North Carolina. I always have to plug myself on this show because you always, and then you yell I at me. I was going to mention that right here. You don't have to, and I do that. This is, this okay. is like you're in first class right now. I take care of everything. Where are the hot nuts? <laughs> Comedy Zone in Charlotte, North Carolina, tomorrow through Saturday. Yes. And Sabrina the Teenage Witch, Friday at 9. Yes. On ABC. Caroline, it's always hilarious. And it's always a pleasure. It's always funny. Caroline Ray, a joy to be with. Mills Lane coming up. We'll be right back.